all the substances in our surrounding are made up of atoms and molecules these atoms and molecules are always at vibratory motion due to this motion substances have an energy known as heat energy this energy flows from hot substances to cold substances or from hot region to cold region of a substance when heat energy is supplied to any substance it increases the energy of the atoms and molecules in it and so they start to vibrate these atoms and molecules which vibrate make other atoms and molecules to vibrate thus heat energy is transferred from one part of the substance to other part we can see this heat energy transfer in our daily life also heat energy brings about lot of changes the effects of heat there are three important changes that we can see in our daily life they are expansion increase in temperature change in state expansion let us take a metal ball and metal ring of a suitable diameter pass the metal ball through the ring you can observe that the metal ball can easily go through it now hit the metal ball and then try to pass it through the ring it will not pass through the ring keep the metal ball on the ring for some time in few minutes it will fall through the ring when ball is heated the atoms in the ball gain heat energy they start vibrating and force each other apart as a result expansion takes place that's why the ball didn't go through the ring after some time as the ball lost the heat energy to the surrounding it came back to its original size and it went through the ring this shows that heat energy causes expansion in solids this expansion takes place in liquids and gases also it is maximum in gases for expansion of solids we can see another one example in railway tracks you would have noticed some space being left in railway tracks why it is so it is because railway tracks which are made up of iron metal expand during summer when there is a gap there will not be any damage in the track due to expansion of the metal rod next one is rise in temperature let us take a cup of water and note its temperature heat the water for few minutes and note the temperature again do you find any increase in the temperature yes we can find the increase of temperature what caused the temperature change when the water is heated water molecules receive heat energy this heat energy supplied increases the kinetic energy of the molecules when the molecules receive more energy the temperature of the water increases this shows that heat energy causes increase in temperature now let us see change of state let us take few ice cubes in a container and heat them for some time the ice cubes melt and become water now heat the water for some time what do you observe the volume of water in the vessel decreases in ice cubes the force of attraction between the water molecules is more so they are close together when we heat them the force of attraction between the molecules decreases and the ice cubes become water when we heat the water the force of attraction decreases further hence they move away from one another and become vapor since water vapor escape to the surrounding water level decreases further from this we understand that heat energy causes change in the state of the substances when heat energy is removed changes take place in the reverse direction if heat energy is supplied to or taken out from the substance it will undergo a change from one state of matter to another one of the following transformations may take place due to heat energy solid to liquid melting liquid to gas vaporization solid to gas sublimation gas to liquid condensation liquid to solid freezing gas to solid deposition so if heat energy is supplied to or taken out from a substance it will undergo a change from one state of matter to another Thank you.